One of the best ways that our nation uh, can really pay them back is not so much in, in terms of money and a paycheck. One of our best ways uh, is to ensure that we take care of their soldiers or take care of their families and their children uh, and to ensure that they have a good education. Uh, that's so fundamental to the future of anybody is to have a good education. Uh, we want to make sure the children of our soldiers, sailors, air marines get a good solid foundational experience in terms of education so they can move on and be productive citizens of the United States. When I think about resilience, I think about children who are able to bounce back uh, from adversity and from challenges. And so oftentimes uh, we come and go, we get stationed overseas, uh, they leave one school district and go to another school district, both in CONUS and overseas. And I think about the fact of uh, however many number of moves that we've made in my 36 years and all of the military parents around the world have made the fact that our kids are resilient and strong and able to uh, be strengthened through adversity and the challenges that they actually live through. And schools are really important to families. And so the more we have the military connected families with MSEC, the more help that is, I think that just brings a peace of mind to our families. Therefore, when our members go to work, they're not burdened down by some of the strife that otherwise might exist. I, probably the biggest thing parents can do to help make sure the schools are meeting their kids needs or helping support their children is to be very actively involved in the school. I think it's important for parents uh, to the extent that they're able to remain actively engaged in their children's education and are paying attention to what's happening and what's not happening in schools and coordinating with and talking with faculty, whether it's administrators or teachers, about those things. I think it's a huge win for both the school and for, and for the child.